Hi guys, good morning. It is Monday morning and I felt like this week would be a really great week to do a video about building a morning routine. I really wanted to do a video this week that was all about building healthy habits in the morning and creating a morning routine. And the thought behind this video is that I would record myself doing these habits that I'm building every single day this week to build up a morning routine. I made myself a list of realistic morning must-haves that no matter what, I could hit every single morning. So the first thing is an alarm clock. When I wake up to no alarm clock, I notice that my day is significantly less productive than if I wake up to an alarm clock. Very niche maybe for me, but something that I've really noticed. Meditate, this is something that I wanna add into my mornings. I currently do not do it. The act of sitting in silence for five, 10, 15 minutes is really hard to do. And I can think of a million reasons why I don't have time to do it, why I shouldn't do it. And I think that's exactly why I should do it. Third is skincare. My mornings feel right when I do skincare. The next is green juice. I just feel so much better when I have green juice in the morning. The next is coffee. I just find that it's a ritual in my morning that just signifies like time to work. Let's get it done. Um, and then right after coffee would be work. Um, and sometimes the first thing I do when I wake up is work and sometimes the last thing in my morning routine that I do is work. In no particular order, those are my morning must-haves. So this video we are going to kind of just document me going through the motions. Um, for me, it's really important that I have flexibility in the mornings. I find that if I have like a really strict routine and if I sleep in a little bit longer or I necessarily don't do them in the order, my mind tends to go to like, oh, you failed at that, like it was a failure. When in reality, it's not failure, it's just life and life happens. What's the saying? It's like life, life happens when we're busy making plans and it's so true. You just have to kind of go with the flow with life sometimes, but I like having like a loose plan. So that is my plan. So um, let's get to work. I actually woke up this morning, started doing a little bit of work and then took a shower. So that's the only thing you guys have missed. So, um, and I woke up this morning at about 7 a.m. Oh, I also already did my skincare too, but I promise I'll show you guys in depth my skincare routine. But okay, let's begin with our morning. So I have these chirp wheels and I figured I may as well stretch out my back while I meditate um, and kill two birds with one stone. Typically what I used to do is I would listen to like a calm or a guided meditation, but today I actually just want to listen to music and try and do it like kind of on my own. So I'm doing the 428 Hertz frequency healing meditation music. And on Spotify, it's the miracle frequency music. And I'm gonna set a timer for 10 minutes today. This didn't really work well, so I'm literally just gonna get a pillow. And I'm just gonna lay on my floor. It is a gorgeous, gorgeous day. I'm going to meditate right here in the sunniest part of my couch. It seems like the perfect place to meditate, even if I can't really see, but I love it so much. a 
great morning and I think it's because of this little morning routine. Um, so that morning routine has only taken me about like 20 minutes to wake up, do a little bit of eye patches, some water, green juice, and meditation, of course. And I just feel really good. What I'm trying to establish, like I said yesterday, is flexibility and structure. But that only took me about 20 minutes and I feel really rested, I feel really good, and I feel really productive. So right now, um, I'm just adding in a couple of things from my podcast last week. Then I'm gonna upload that onto the YouTube channel. And then I'm probably going to go downstairs and get a package because I got this gradual tanner delivered. Um, I'm gonna send a couple emails, upload this, and then upload the Stride at Home videos onto the site. And then while all that stuff is uploading, I'm gonna jump in the shower and um, do my shower and skincare and put on the gradual tanner. And then I'm gonna get to work after that. Well, actually after that, I'm gonna make a cup of coffee and watch a how-to video on YouTube because I need to do that for my work today. So I just took a shower. So really quick, I'll just run through the products that I'm gonna use for my skin and my body. So for my cleanser, I use the Osea Ocean Cleanser. My cap broke off when I flew to Idaho. So I just like scoop it out of the bottle. So the Osea Facial Cleanser. And then I put on the Paula's Choice advanced replenishing toner with hyaluronic acid this is like heaven and then i put on the paula's choice c15 super booster this is vitamin c i love this stuff it is like can't go a day without it i really love it and then normally for moisturizer i use the clinique moisture surge intense but i'm out and it's actually coming tomorrow but for the time being, I'm using the Tatcha, the Dewy Skin Cream. Um, it's fine. I just really like the Clinique one like so much. And then for sunscreen, I either put on the Super Goop Glow Screen or the Dermatology Medical Grade Skincare Universal Tinted Moisturizer with SPF 46. I'll put this on. I'll probably put this on today. And if I want some color to my face, like if my body's tan but my face is not, I will add in the Deep Bronzy Anti-Pollution Sunshine Drops from the Drunk Elephant just with this. Um, but it really just depends on the day. But that is my daily skincare every day. And I just took a shower and I just got this in the mail. The Lux Unfiltered Hydrating Self-Tanning Cream. So I'm gonna put this on and I am so excited to try this out. I like almost did a tanning bed the other day and I was like, what are you doing? Like you spend so much money on skincare, you are not about to ruin it by going into a tanning bed when there are so many products out there that are cheaper than tanning beds. So we're gonna do this. So, okay, I'm gonna do my skincare. I don't know how people can talk right after they wake up. I'm really sorry, I always have like the worst morning voice for a while. Oh, wait, I wanted to actually wash my face first. That Osea cleanser is like literally the best. It just feels so good. Like literally the best feeling ever. 
over once you get the right cleanser. I slept with the window open last night because my apartment was like so hot. But it was like 20 degrees out last night, which is crazy because today it's gonna be 50 and tomorrow it's gonna be 70. I just can't with Pennsylvania March weather. Like get it together, please. So my skin and like lips feel super dry. So um, I do my eye patches under my eyes. And I also just ordered a new eye cream that's coming today. So I'm excited to use that tonight and tomorrow morning. Um, I think it's the Laneige one. I don't know though. I forget. But I'm also going to do a sheet mask. And to be honest, I don't do these a lot because they're really cold on my face. And I hate the feeling of cold in the morning. I just want to be like wrapped up in warmth when I wake up. So I tend to not do these a lot because they're way too cold. But my skin feels really dry. So I will make an exception today. But another reason that I don't like doing these is because they get in my hair. And I hate that feeling. And I wanted to wash my face first so that I wouldn't have to like wash this off. You know, this feels really good in the summertime when you're hot. Ugh, I cannot keep it on for too long. Number one, I can't talk with it on. And number two, it's just so cold on my face. So I put on um, a nose strip last night and it did pretty good, I'd say. It actually brought a white head up, which is interesting. So I think I'll just put a mighty patch on it. I went to Target last night and bought them, which obviously makes me so late to the trend of them because they've been around for you know, so long. Okay, so what is in store today? I was supposed to work out this morning, but honestly, I'm on like the biggest creative role ever and I don't want to interrupt it. So um, I moved my workout and I'm working out tonight now, but I spent all day yesterday making my planners, like I said, and the day flew by like i'm not even kidding like it literally flew by i looked at the clock and it was one o'clock and i was like how did that happen and then i took like a 10 minute break and then i moved over to the couch and then i kept working on the couch and then suddenly it was five o'clock i'm like literally how did this happen um and then i was working on it like late last night too it's just been like it just just the biggest creative role. So I want to continue with that today. And I also have to edit a video today. And I have a um, stride meeting from three to five. And then I'm going into the studio tonight to train a new employee. But I'll show you guys how the planners look so far. They finally have a name. They're called the Manifest Planner. And they are first going to be available as a digital download because that is going to be the quickest way to get it out to you guys. But then the physical version is gonna look exactly like the digital planner. And I just think that's like, sorry, I don't mean to flip you off. I just think that's like the cutest thing ever. Once you see like the digital planner and knowing that it's gonna look exactly like that, but like in a little book, it's gonna be so cute. <laughs> this is the Wegmans Green Glory Juice. You could totally make this at home, but it's just made with, um, it's apples, pineapple, kale, spinach, wheatgrass, celery, and lemon. And it's so delicious. It's just easier to buy this, honestly, than like make it every morning. But I guess I'll, no, I'll get a little bit more. Uh, or should I just finish it? I may as well just finish it, huh? But you could like totally make this every morning in a juicer. 
Wegmans makes like this big one and it takes me like five days to go through it, which is perfect. Okay, so look how freaking cute it is. It is so cute. So little pages, little tabs. Oh my God, it's like so cute. I can't even deal. Um, I'm currently making my master slides. So this is like the base of all of them. And then this is the year at a glance. The digital will be dated. This is the year at a glance. I think it is so freaking cute. The tabs, I don't know. The tabs are just sending me. I think they are so cute. Um, I'm like really amazed by myself that I made this. Like I made all of this from scratch. Um, Emma, my designer, helped me with these designs. And this, I chose the color palettes. She like helped me put stuff where they needed to be. But I can't believe I like did these little, I don't know. The tabs are sending me. Okay, so that's the year, um, and then I obviously just have to add like the months, the dates, and hyperlinks to everything. And then this is the monthly spread, and I have it starting on a Monday, because does that just make more sense than starting on a Sunday? I don't know. So it's Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. And then there's monthly reviews, so this is the monthly review. There's a weekly time block. So this is your time block because I currently am time blocking and it's like saving my life. And then you have your week at a glance, meals, workouts, weekly goals, grocery list, morning routine, night routine, and then a habit tracker. And then I'm going to go in and make the master daily slide now. And then once the master daily slide is done, then I will start to edit my video. Um, to be honest, I really just want to work on this all all day um, But I really do need to edit my video because if I don't do it today Then I won't have time to do it this week Since this is about morning routines, I figured I would show you guys What I've been having for breakfast every single day. I go in like really big phases with breakfast Like I'll eat the same thing every single day for like three weeks and then I'll switch it up so right now and it doesn't happen that way like I don't plan for it to happen that way it just does happen that way so right now I'm really into two pieces of toast buttered with two eggs um, sunny side up and they're like cooked pretty much all the way through the only thing that's runny is the yolk the best bread in the whole world is Dave's killer bread it is so good two pieces of toast and I'm about to butter these and these are the eggs and I put butter in the pan on the eggs. Oh, and I put lots of lemon pepper on my eggs. This is a fake cactus. <laughs> it's Friday morning and like reading this morning. I'm gonna read a book, I'm gonna meditate, and I'm gonna write three things in my gratitude journal because I just feel like that today. And then I'm gonna take a shower, do skincare, get ready for the day, and I have a call in one hour. Okay guys, that's gonna end my video. I'm currently editing it right now. Um, I really fell off on Thursday and Friday. Well, my camera was dead Thursday morning when I woke up, so that was my bad. And then Friday, I don't know. I just like stopped recording. No idea why. But anyway, this was a really great video. Um, I've been sticking to my routine that I've done. And like I said, on Tuesday, it literally only took me like 20 minutes to do all of that. And I had such a productive day last Tuesday. So this is just a really simple routine. I'd love to know your morning must-haves in the comments below. And if you guys want to see more videos like this, let me know. But I'll see you guys next week. Bye.